Hey what's going on guys, it's CK here and today welcome back to Forza Motorsports 6 for a review of the Infinity Q60 concept. Now I was talking about this in my first video of the brand new DLC with the Caparo. I'm very very glad they brought this car in because design wise it is one of the top dogs from the past couple of years seriously. It looks very very nice from every angle. It is basically the replacement for the G37 and ho oh, oh, my god, I really, really hope it gets made. It looks absolutely stunning. So, anyway, we have come to Road... Uh, Road Atlanta? What the fuck? Circuit of Americas. That's what I was going to say. Jesus Christ, man. How can I get them mixed up? But, yeah. <laughs> I'm actually really, really eager to see what this thing is going to be like. Because it's got a twin turbo V6 putting out 400 horsepower and 400 pounds feet of torque. So, we're all right on the power front. So let's hear how she sounds, that she sounds, Sean Connery mode, let's hear how she sounds. Not bad, not bad, quite, quite GTR sounding, not as howly or as aggressive as the GTR, but you know what I mean, it does sound pretty damn nice. We'll spin. Not bad, so it's been a little while since we've been on Circuit of the Americas. I believe the last time it was the JAG review, like the XKRS review, so it has been a long time. Bad in terms of giving in the first corner there. Ooh, I'm not too sure, is this rear wheel drive or four wheel drive? It kind of feels like both, but I mean, I'm pretty sure it's rear wheel drive, but it definitely feels a little bit four wheel drive ish. God, the, bo the body roll as well, that's a bit excessive for this thing. God, you can see it. Oh, ho, ho. so far it's reminded me of the Lexus RCF. That's what it's kind of, well, rival is, kind of, because it is a coupe with an about 400 horsepower. So, yeah. It's definitely reminding me of that. You can get it sideways quite easily, though. You can feel the car just freaking swaying from side to side. Look at this. It's pretty good. Pretty good. I like it. Oh, keep her going. Keep her going. This thing is great for drifting. But the thing I want to talk about right now, guys, is a little surprise. There's a little surprise for you. I don't know if you know um, that Tomcat, aka Forest, is coming to the UK next week. And let's just say we might have a little bit of a surprise on store for you. Like, both of us might have a little bit of a surprise. So, yeah, keep your eyes peeled over the next couple of weeks on both of our channels. That's all I'm saying. That is all I'm saying. So, cannot wait to show you guys. It's going to be pretty damn fun indeed. So, jumping into the interior for the second lap. Not too shabby. Well, it is a concept, so everything is, like, turned up to 11. It looks great. Bet full race, Alex, eat your heart out. <laughs> I'm only kidding. <laughs> if we'd done like a head to head race, well, I mean, he'd spank me. So, slap, slap something next. Can we beat him around here? So, I want to see if it, we can actually get a decent time in with this car. Oh, God. Now, the steering wheel actually gives off quite a good sense of like grip and stuff, even though I don't use a wheel. But just by looking at it and just the way it's positioned, it's just perfect. It is perfect. The perfect width. The perfect, like, overall feel. Oh, yes, power down, power down. It's not bad. It could use a little bit of weight reduction, but apart from that, it's perfectly fine. It is perfectly fine. And it's setting gear for that pill section. Oh, yes. Whoa. <laughs> like, slapping right into them freaking tires there, man. Now, let me know in the comments below, guys. What is your favourite car? from this month's DLC pack, the first DLC, DLC, <laughs> DLC mate, how you doing, how you doing mate, coming to you live from Sydney, Australia, uh, but yeah, <laughs> uh, what's your favourite car from this month's DLC, I'm not too sure what to pick, the limo that uh, Bowman spanked around the rubber ring last night was a hell of a lot of fun, if you've not already seen that video guys, the little thing will come up on the screen in a little second, the video itself, so Click that after this video, or it's, in, it's on the end card anyway. It's on the end card for crying out loud, but yeah, it's a really, really fun time that limo. Same with this thing. Same with this. Now, I chose it in red 
because I know the manufacturer colour is kind of like a uh, strange looking silver but this thing looks amazing in red, it's unbelievable, it's just, it just popped out, really did, same with the yellow, you know what I mean, I was just flicking through the colours and this thing, yellow and red is the colours to go for this thing, it really really is now, I don't know what this would be like with like another 400 horsepower, like 800 horsepower, because I can probably get that up, probably get this up there if I've done a build of it, but holy shit! You can hold a freaking long drift right around that corner on this. Damn, I like it. I like it. Really good. <laughs> I mean, for stock car, this drifts like a peach. Right, so I'm going to do something that I've not done before. Go backwards around Circuit of the Americas. I think that's the name of the track. I always get mixed up. I always call it Circuit of the Americans, but I know a lot of you guys have said in the comments, it's not that, it's Circuit of the Americas, I believe. Can't remember if I'm wrong. It says it on that building. What does it say? Circuit of the Americas. There we go. It's quite confusing. It's quite confusing. I just, <laughs> I just want to say Americans. You know what I mean? Whoa! Two wheels! Two wheels! Oh, we held it. Oh, Jesus Christ! <laughs> I mean, the curbs in this game are lethal. They really are. As soon as you just go onto it, it's like, nope. We're gonna flip you, mate. We're gonna flip you. I don't give a shit who you are. I don't give a shit how good a driver you are. We're gonna flip you into oblivion. Now, apparently the top speed in this thing is 189 miles an hour. Doesn't really feel that fast in my opinion. <laughs> Probably like 160, 170. I would have thought the top speed was, but yeah, 189, that's according to the game, and four seconds to zero to sixty, so I ain't gonna I ain't gonna judge, that's just my own opinions. I think it's a wee bit slower than the power makes it out to be. Okay, this is going to be new for me. Getting down this little section downhill. Yes. Keep it going, keep it going. Try and get a massive combo going here, because I know there's a big sweeping corner down this bit. Keep it in the third. I think that's a bright idea. Ooh. Yes, yes. Come on. Infinity. Was really call it a Cadillac. Don't know why. No, I told you. The curbs are lethal. Okay, attempt number two. I'm going to try that again. I thought that was going to let go again. Thought it was going to go full Elsa mode. Well, I mean, let that song go already and let the freaking curbs in this game go! Fuck! Ay, 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 ay. You've not been good to me today, are you, sucker of the Americas? Because I got your name wrong, you're pissed. <laughs> you're like, hell no. Hell no, I ain't letting you get away with that, mate. Holy shit. I'm going to need a second gear for this bit. That was a clutch drop and a half there. Whoa, what? <laughs> this feels so weird going downhill like this, but you see everything. That is pretty cool. That is really, really cool. I've never seen it going like back the way like that. It's nice. Pretty nice, but anyway, guys, I think we're going to round this video off here with a new badge unlocked. Y'all do. Um, but yeah, it's a good car, this thing. It is a pretty good car. Um, I probably have to put a little bit of weight reduction in it, as I said, a bit more power as well, but for stock, it's extremely good at drifting, and that's about all it can do, really. It's kind of similar to the Jag, like the F-Type and that, because you know that thing was built up for it, but I'm sure if you stick like race tyres on it, you would get quite a good circuit car out of this, but yeah, I'm going to end the video here. Sorry if it was quite short, but... Yeah, just wanted to do a little short little drive in this thing, so let me know what you make of the car in the comments below. I feel like doing a fucking donut right now. Let's do this thing. Yes, let me know what you make of the car, and also leave a like on the video, subscribe to the channel, and follow me on Facebook and Twitter. Links are in the description below. No hand, no hands except on the celery. I'm going to crash! No, I'm not. Quick reflexes, like a freaking cat. <laughs> but anyway, see you next time, guys and the little Volvo which is going to be coming soon. Thanks for watching. Peace.